What's gonna happen? Get those, get the mines down. Get the mines down. It's definitely not looking good for. It's, it's okay. The mines, the mines are gonna shoot. They, they hit the overseers though, which isn't what you wanted. There's a, there should be mines over here. Where are the mines? Medivacs dying to mutilists. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no! All those beautiful medivacs. Well, at least, at least you have turrets. Okay, you're fine. Where's his army gone? Okay, it looks like you cleaned it up. Just defenders' advantage, as they say. Mm. You see, well, he seemed to have a. He seemed to have a good bit there, kind of coming in here, but he didn't actually manage to. Well, he had a lot of mute and he couldn't go anywhere near it because of all the towers. So you were actually fine in the end. But uh, he definitely has the upper hand now, though, and it looks like he's priming himself up for another run by into your fourth base, which is uh, just gone up now. You're just warping, or not warping it. You're transforming it into a uh, fourth. Is it? Oh, it is too. I thought it was an orbital. Again, I'm going to uh, get caught no, on creep. Yeah, yeah, you're caught on creep. Zerg units travel a lot faster on that creep. Uh, advantage, definitely Zerg. He's got oh, there's so many mules there. If he he's not he's not going for the mules. Uh, he doesn't maybe doesn't realise what he's doing, but he seems to yeah, he seems to just kind of he's a real hard on for this base over here right now. Uh, and yeah. lose all his muted to turrets. He's losing his muted to turrets, which is good. But you're losing all your SCVs to banelings and lings, which isn't super good for you. Uh, yeah. Not looking good for you, Jimmy, I think. But, no. uh, well, you do have all this perfect mining going on here, which is completely undefended, which he completely missed. <laughs> what, the, the fourth the base? The fourth base, yeah. He ran straight past that. He could have actually, you could have wiped all of this out, and he still it, would have been able to wipe all of your third base out. So It is a fourth, fifth, 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 though. So, you know, they can be hard was to take down with just lingers. I don't think it was fully up by then, was it? It was just morphing. It was nearly finished when he attacked. Have you looked at seen his ultras? His ultras look very uh, fancy. F fancy, yes. Uh, that is the uh, no it's special edition or something. It right? could be the special edition. I don't know. I don't play Zerg, uh, but if you think they look different, yeah, they are the special <laughs> edition. Uh, stuff going on. You attacked his fifth, fifth, fourth. Uh, he did manage to borrow though. So he borrowed. Not... Yeah, he borrowed all of his uh, his drones. Uh, handy. You could have scanned, but uh... I guess I just wasn't looking at the time. I'm very surprised he hasn't taken a fifth. Actually, to be honest. Um, it's a bit insane he hasn't taken a fifth. And he isn't even getting gas from his fourth. Oh, my, yeah, he's actually mined out of gas in his first. So he's actually on less gas now than he was. Oh, now he's getting gas in his fourth. All right. So you're 30 supply behind. Uh, he's sticking with his Ling. Not so much bling, but he's also got ultras now. He's so. got the ultras, yeah. So what are you going to do to deal with the ultras? Well, if you have a good amount of marauders and marines uh marauders will take care of the ultras anyway so it's true he has the ultra uh armor upgrade so he's sitting at five armor he's oh the chitinous plating is it he's a two two but i have three weapons but that doesn't really that just cancels each other out marines still only being nap bites on ultralis oh now he's getting the blings he's getting a lot of blings now how are you going to deal with this i don't know to be honest i fi i think it'll be very very hard for you to keep your uh, your, your fourth up against all of this. The good thing is he doesn't have any mute anymore because um, those ultras are probably taking all of his gas. As I say that though, <laughs> I glance to the top right of the screen and see that he's floating 2,000 gas at the moment. <laughs> even though he's only on 128 supply. Minerals seem to be the... Uh... It's because he's making too much ling. That's his problem. He's made way too much ling. Which are, which are just probably just gonna, all going to die to mm. mines. I think that you're you're correct in saying that uh, he needs to uh, take another base. Uh, he is actually he's taking one of the middle bases for minerals. Just now, yeah. But uh, yeah, he's, As, he's, he is fully saturated. Well, actually, he's completely mined out of his first and second, so he's only mining minerals off two bases right now. It's not for I I I feel that this this particular Zerg's uh, economy management hasn't been extremely good. All right, what are you going to do now? Oh dear. The bailing hits are going in. They hit you on marauders, a, though. You, you lost a lot of, well, you lost a lot of marauders there, but he didn't manage to get everything. Uh, you're chasing him down right now. I don't know why he just doesn't turn back. He still has three, four ultras there. Um, I think he could have taken you if he turned around. He needs something to keep them in position. There's no infestors that, uh, that I can see. Yeah, that's true. You could just stutter step him, couldn't you? You feel that your stutter step uh, technique is, is down enough to take out an army of that magnitude? I don't know. Maybe we'll see later in the game. <laughs> I see you're getting a fifth now, and you're just getting... Yeah, I think that you... 
To be honest, you've actually got 4,500 gas. I don't know what the hell you're doing. Uh, bio tends to be very, very heavy on minerals, and gas seems to be uh, not really an important commodity in the bio composition, so... Okay, if you say so. That seems like an <laughs> awful lot, though. I think you could have probably built battle cruisers at this stage, with all the gas you have. What kind of upgrades do you have? Two, three? That's pretty good. Oh my god, you're getting all this muta? Yeah, all that expensive muta. Big catch there. He's still going to just fly into my yeah, base. Yeah, if only you had a mine there. It would have done so much damage. Where's all your mines? Yeah, he's still flying around. He you might be able to gotta... stop the plus three. Nah. Nah, he flies out and for some reason gets caught by all the marines. Again, that are in the same place that they were when they caught him the first time. Where's he going with those now? He's just having a bit of a jolly walk around. He's going to die to those two. Okay. Yeah. Can I see active forces? So your army actually at the moment is bigger than his. Although, mm, well actually it's pretty evenly matched to be honest. He has a lot more gas intensive units which uh, wouldn't be surprised at and that's just the ultras. See actually, to be honest, he's not actually making many units because he seems to be completely uh. mineral bound. Okay. A lot of bailing hits here. Yeah, a lot of bailing hits. If only you had something to kind of, you know, control his army, like, you know how Protoss can kind of just throw down the force fields, or Zerg can just throw down fungals. You don't really seem to have anything like that as Terran, do you? No, they need some kind of net. Yeah. Do, do Terran have anything like that? Uh, to hold them in position? No. Uh, you have point defense drones. But, uh, uh, that's Terran not. is like it when people come towards them. They're not really sort of for catching, catching out people. Hmm. There aren't very many spells or anything. Well, you have ghosts, they can do EMPs, but that doesn't really work very well against against Zerg, unless you're doing it against Infestors to get rid of their energy. Or Vipers, which uh, this guy obviously does not like the spellcasters. Um, yeah, if he was using Vipers, he could probably hammer you, because uh, he just throw down the, the cloud, and... Uh, That'd be the end of that. That would pretty much be the end of that, yeah. Um, he, he, like... I think it is as simple as that, really. Maybe it's not. I could run away. <laughs> <laughs> the yeah, but you'd have to run backwards, and then while you're running, then he just come in with you with all his uh, with all his banelings. All right, he's going for your your new base, your your fifth. Or oh, is he? He is, I think. Yeah. And you now? Do you actually know you're going for sixth base now? By the way, okay, okay, he's got yeah, he's got you. He cleared that up with what he had, yeah. and you're cutting off his uh, his reinforcements here. You've actually overtaken him supply now for the first time probably since very early in the game. But of course you're only killing lings really, which uh let's face it are pretty pretty expendable. <laughs> uh two okay, for one now bargain. here's here's the big battle, alright? If you can take if you can take two to three of these ultras, you'll be alright, one down, two down, three down, alright, and you've still got the majority of your army. And there we go, it's the fourth one gone down. Alright, so now you're back in the driver's seat. He lost all his really expensive, really important ultras. He's still very low on minerals, and he only has two. And actually, I just noticed now that you dropped his base over here in the bottom left. Uh, he only has two bases mining minerals, and he's really low. You're about to take one of them. Here we go. Okay, he's in trouble now. He's in big trouble. He's down to 105 supply. He can't rebuild his army because he doesn't have any minerals, because you've dropped one of them. And even though you're gone, he still hasn't unburrowed his... He hasn't his... unburrowed yeah. them. Yeah. Even though right, he's, yeah, he's in the serious ultra. trouble now. He's got a... Because you're still mining, you've still got you've still got mules going down. Where have you got your mules? Nowhere. You you pr you probably have so much mules that you could be dropping, but you're obviously just <laughs> so excited with attacking. You haven't dropped any of them down. Okay, he's actually got some ultras out now. Can you stutter step your way away? Can you? Steam going down. You're gonna steam yourself to jet to death. There's just too much drugs. Oh my god! <laughs> There's one ultra that's on like no health. You're not tag. You're targeting the other ones. All right, you got it. You got it. Okay, okay, okay. Two of them down. One of them. Yeah. Okay, okay. You did it. Wow. That was pretty insane, actually. If only he had something a bit more than just ultras. <laughs> yeah, as and we've been were, saying, no game long. That was all. One thing we have to add is that that was all on creep as well. Where where they're as fast as they can be. <laughs> so you know, if that was off creep, it probably would have been a lot easier for you. Not a chance. Yeah, that's as he said. He needs really to incorporate infestors into his army uh, yeah, to keep those marines yeah. in check. Yeah, if that was my advice for him, I would say, well, if he. A bit more spell casting, a few vipers, lay down your, your poot loud, um, and a few infestors, 
his uh, his EVT would be a lot better. Um, now he's got Terran army in his base. He's just mining. Yeah, he's mining off one base. Uh, Terran's everywhere. He's trying to get out a few lings, a few blings, uh -huh. but uh, I just it's just not enough. He doesn't have any minerals left. Yeah, his his, his natural has gone down. You're marching in straight, and you're going to get his, you're going to get his ultra's cavern. You're going to get his hive. Uh, yeah. He doesn't have any answer to this at all. He's sending out a few lings. Probably going to try and, and cut off your uh, your economy, but at this at this stage, it's uh, it's been pretty futile. You're you're sitting on well, you were sitting on two thousand minerals, so and you're at, you're at 163. So you're 100 supply ahead, so I think this is uh, this is just he's coming into the top base. He is, but it doesn't matter anymore. Uh, he's not going to be able to get through your your mighty wall anyway over here, and there are mines sitting there. This mine's gonna gonna do the business. There we go. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, he won't be able to get through this anyway, and if he, even if he does, uh, and I imagine there should be some reinforcements coming out here somewhere to, to tidy up these couple of uh, these couple of things. Uh, if I was him, I would have GG'd by now. Uh, he fights to the end, though. He's uh, <laughs> he's an honourable opponent who uh, has respect for himself and his opponent. So uh, hats off to him, brave uh, Ashud. But uh, come on now, buddy. He fights till the end. Yeah. Till his last well, breath. Well, he is still mining, so from his perspective... Here we go. GG. GG. Okay. Yeah, that was a marathon. Yeah. Quite a long game. Certainly was. But uh, you were the victor. Uh, I think that it could have gone It could have gone either way. It definitely could have gone in his, on his fa in his favour uh, if he had just, just changed his army composition a, li a little bit. But... Uh, he didn't want to. <laughs> both uh, both players employing a simplistic army composition. Uh, yes, because you didn't stray too far from the Marines and Marauders and, and Widowmakers. I uh, medevac, sorry. MMA. MMA. Yeah. Did you um? And Widowmines. Did you get anything else like that? No, you didn't get any tanks, any Thors. No. You stayed away no. from Mech. No, you, yeah, you want to try and keep with either one or one or the other. Helps with your upgrades. It uh, does, but if you can do the switch at the right time. They might be expecting it. Exactly. Catch them off guard. Okay. I uh, have another game here if you want to. It's a shorter game. It's about half the length of the other one. All right, go for it. Play. Come on, Jim. Are you not with me? What do you mean? You're not in the game with me? No. Ah, there we go. Download. Watch. Alright, so this is uh, TVT. Uh, Cobra Chops versus uh, Medal Ike from the clan Ook. Uka. Uh, no, just Ook. I think. Now he has quite a quite a cool uh, picture there. Um, I'm not sure what the hell that's supposed to be. Some kind of Call of Duty ghost. Is it? I don't know. It looks no, like that's, it. that's not like that's not like It's it. definitely war paint or something. Anyway. Oh, you reckon? I think it's supposed to be some kind of skeleton man. Mm. Anyway. Alright, so nothing happening at the start. Uh, a few a few spy depots going down. Nothing crazy happening. No uh, no SCV all in or or anything like that. Uh, which is good because uh, SCV all in games aren't very good to look at because they're a pile of dog shit. That's true, yeah. No <laughs> one no one likes to see uh, some kind of gimmicky all-in. Nah. Well, I like to see a gimmicky all-in if it requires a bit of skill to execute it. Uh, I, d I definitely don't like to see it if um, if you're just selecting all of your SCVs and they moving into the opponent's base. It's <laughs> uh, just a waste of time. Waste of my time. Waste of his time. Waste of his time because he'll just lose. All right, Orbital Command going up. Uh, he's, uh, he's already got three gas. Quite early gas for uh, for Terran, I think. 
Would you agree there? Uh, I think the gas times are pretty standard on both sides.